Hello. Today I'll be showing a demonstration of our work titled A Multimodal Decision Support System with Allergy Aware Recipe Understanding. Since food is not only a basic human necessity but also a key factor driving a society's health and economic well being, the need to build and deploy decision support tools in it has been on the rise. To handle that, we need an AI that understands the concepts in the food domain, is tolerant to failures encountered while cooking, handles allergy based substitutions, and the interrelationships between multiple data modalities. With that, I present the system a multimodal decision support system with allergy aware recipe understanding. Coming on to the system architecture, the input to our system architecture is the text document of the recipe and external knowledge related to different ingredients and their allergen category. We enrich the textual record into a rich recipe representation format, which enhances and improves the performance of the information retrieval system. The system is a simple web-based interface that supports multimodal constraint-based queries on 25 unique recipes. Before we move on to the system's functionality, let us quickly understand the R3 format and how it enhances the input data. Here on the right hand side of the screen, we see the original unstructured text document of the recipe and on the left hand side, we see the R3 representation for it. Here the ingredient information is converted to a structured format making it easier to understand the ingredient quantity, quality characteristic and the allergen category associated with each ingredient. In this next example, we have an instruction in the unstructured format which is transformed into a set of atomic actions along with planning inspired predicates for cooking instructions input and output conditions that define the requirements and the products for specific instruction. Both the instructions and the ingredients also have associated images. Here on the screen we see the user web interface which supports multimodal querying of recipes and allows users to perform different constraint based queries. There are two significant types of constraint based queries. The first one is a process constraint based query. These are the kind of queries that constraints on the process of the recipe that is filtering recipe by length type of cooking contribute to process constraint. Here the user asks give me a recipe with 9 steps. To this query treat obtains 9 recipe matches out of which here we can see the top 6 recipes with their final images. We also see the additional allergen information. Further we have an option of viewing the entire recipe which opens a new page with the JSON object of the recipe. Then we have outcome constraints based queries. These are the kind of queries that constrain the recipe's outcome that is filtering recipe by ingredient name, allergen falls under outcome constraints. Here the user asks give me recipe with egg in it. To this query the system obtains a total of 14 matches. Here we see top 6 output recipes ordered based on their similarity with the query. Along with textual modality the system also supports image modality. Here the user inputs an image of bacon to which the system identifies 6 recipes and displays those 6 on the UI. With the help of R3 on the back end, the system also supports allergen based queries. Here the user asks give me recipe without egg allergen. In this query the user explicitly mentions the allergen category and the system matches the query with 4 recipes and displays those 4 on the user web interface we see here. If the user asks give me recipe without parsley allergen, in this query parsley is not an allergen category but it is an ingredient that falls under the leave allergen category. Here we can see that the system matches the query with 22 recipes and display the top 6 on the user web interface. Further, the system also supports both text and image based query simultaneously. Here user asks give me a recipe without cow's milk allergen and uploads an image of pepper. Here the system outputs 12 recipes and displays the top 6 on the user web interface we see here. 